Hi guys, so this is one of our areas where we are, that we clean. This is one of the salon suites. We entered in, and as you can see, I'm going really fast here. You walk in, this is behind the door, the lights. You can flip it, it kind of goes a little backwards to turn it on and off. As we go through, we only clean the main areas. The We vacuum the carpet, we clean the um, room, the table, we wipe the chairs, we um, make sure everything looks neat and presentable. This here is a uh, washer and we take this out, we clean it, uh, make sure that you clean the filter and this is like another filter at the bottom. Um, I'll send you a separate video in regarding to this here so you can see how to clean it and brush it out. Um, but I'm just taking it out so you can see what it is, where it is. Wipe the counters, change the trash. A lot of, sometimes the trash is not filled up. I kind of just empty it into another trash. Open the refrigerator to make sure nothing is spilled. I don't throw or toss anything out. I don't know who um, these things belong to, so I just leave it there until after a while. Maybe the owner comes and she takes it out. But details, um, eye for details here, like I just pointed at um, the cobwebs or um, bugs on the, the wall. Uh, walking back through. Um, oh, I think I turned around because I don't think the lights, all the lights were not on, but I do clean this area here, sweep out the corners, and sometimes I even sweep the um, outside. And that can, that's right there. A, a lot of times people just think that's a trash can. I don't know, they just throw trash in there, so empty it out. This is um, the other hallway. I think I'm walking back around to turn the lights on. I think that's what I'm doing. But in that hallway, there was the utility room. Yeah, I think that's what I'm doing because the lights weren't turned on. So I'm going back down the other hallway. On the left is the utility room. That's where you will find the garbage bags. The um, I don't use any of the cleaning products. We use our own. But you'll see the garbage bags of tissue is kept in here. Um, I recently kind of straightened this area out. Uh, the um, soap dispenser is also in here. That's where the tissues are kept. The soap dispenser to change the soap out is on the actual rack. I don't think I went over that, but it's in there. Um, I've trained you on how to clean. Uh, make sure you just pay attention. Have an eye for detail. Cleaning the insides of the bowls and around the corners, underneath. Just uh, making sure that you have an eye for detail here. Um, cleaning the the mirror, wiping everything down. I do. That's the soap dispenser up top. I wipe this wall because a lot of times the soap is just left and you can see it stain the wall, so I do wipe the wall. Again, um, just have an eye for detail and making sure that things are clean and sanitized properly. Uh, so, um, just wait to see what else I'm doing here. I think I probably went down on the ground, but... What are you doing? Oh, I think I was changing that out. So yeah, we wanna make sure that there are at least two rolls of toilet tissue in each bathroom and wiping around a lot of times. Believe it or not, urine gets down here. And so this should be wiped every single time. I take these knobs off and I wash them out um, pretty much every time. Sometimes, not all the time, but I try to just pay attention to make sure that it's cleaned and no urine or hair or anything is underneath it. Um, mop, sweep and mop, and just sanitize the areas. Uh, ever so often I will clean the floors with um, a grout brush 
it, it's it's you know every so often maybe once or once every other month I may do a deep I do a deeper clean and yeah um, trying to see what else I'm doing here oh yeah I'm just I take the rag I'll go down I get down on my knees and sanitize and wipe down again just paying attention to details making sure that it's not there's nothing obvious i wipe the walls it doesn't take a lot to to wipe the walls off and i'm trying to see what else i think that's it um if there any, if anything thing else comes to mind oh yeah you see that like it may or may not come off, but if it does, just, you know, try to clean it, get it off. That's the soap dispensary. Um, they, we have that in the, in the utility closet and for the paper napkins, that's in the closet on the right hand side. And you would press the button on the top up here and change it out. I guess I'm back over here again because it seemed to be important, you know? Toilets are important, very much so. So welcome back. This is part two of going to the salon and I'm just showing you how to enter in and um, ooh, look like I'm running here. I think what, ha what happened is the alarm thing wasn't working. And so I had to run to disarm it because it wasn't, the battery must have been low in the front. Boy, I was taking off now. Ooh, so I just wanted to take some time to kind of go back through the salon and just go over a few more details in regarding to um, the space here. So... Uh, got the lights on, turn them on, I deactivated the alarm. And one of the things that I had did not mention, um, oh, you can see little hairs on the ground. Yeah, so make sure that you're paying attention to details and get those hairs vacuum because uh, they will be there because sometimes clients are walking out, they don't realize that they have hair on them their shoe but this is where the paper napkins are right here I had to come back and just tell you that little bit of a detail and as you can see this is where the soap dispensary is and yep so whenever the soap gets low or all the way out you can it's right here and I'll show you how to put that in so um, going back around and oh little bug on the ground little hair make sure we get all those little details and going to the back door and as you can see here just make sure that is clean and I don't know why people like to throw stuff in that little thing but please clean it out if you see it uh, clean the inside of the glass outside of the glass and in this little corner here sometimes you want to pull this out and go to the back of this sometimes we have little bugs back there as you can see so i will be sweeping it out today and this is the washing machine here someone left their towel in there hopefully i come back and get it um so go, just going through here checking the restroom um, as you can see there's only one tissue in here so we do need to have two tissue in the restroom at all times empty the trash you see there's trash in there and sweep mop and make sure that we clean the glass again um, not for sure what I'm doing here, what I'm trying to say, but oh, yeah, check this and make sure that it's full. Um, you just want to squeeze on the side and check paper towel, make sure that they are 
full enough in it. So we're going over to the uh, first restroom here. And it won't be too bad, you know, but now you know. But we have the same problem at home, so not surprised. But change the uh, the tissue and clean the glass and as you can see this is when it's this low I just go ahead and just take it out and I replace it with a new one okay so we'll be uh, I will be uploading another tutorial video after this one um, I do have some more details thank you so much